This video is about Sora, the new OverDrive app. It started on the App Store, Android, and Kindle, and then now come to browser, which is great for our Chromebooks. When you're in OverDrive, you can click Try Sora in your browser. It'll first take you here. Uh, the very first time you have to sign in, you have to find your school, but after that, it'll just take you to yours. Because of our internet host and connection, it sometimes thinks we're in Columbia, so we have to find my school, so click Find My School. You simply type in your zip code, and click LSR7 Schools, that's us. You probably know that. Once you get logged in, uh, it will take you here. This login is the same as the OverDrive information. It might even save it from your OverDrive account. Uh, it is built for schools, so you will see assignments up first, though we don't use that much. You'll see all the books you checked out currently, and then underneath that, uh, it'll recommend some books based upon your previous reading. Explore at the bottom is really where we get into the fun stuff. Uh, available now, you'll see that there are over 2,700 titles available right now. Again, if it doesn't have anything, it's a book. If it has the headphones, that's an audio book. Uh, you can click into it to find out some details over here, right? Also, if you're interested in something similar, I like these recommendations on the side. Um, if we want to break out, you can see all of the available books broken out by different titles here. But let's say we're really interested in a mystery or um, a sports book or something like that. A few interesting things. Um, you can see if it has a hold or if you can borrow it right now very easily. If it has a hold, it kind of gives you an indication of how long it will be. Uh, a one dot is usually a week or less. Two is two to three weeks. And three dots are three or more. So if we click on this one, um, right here where that has a hold uh, it'll tell us underneath it's about four weeks also maybe you want something like that right now you can click on one of these tags over here and it will give you books that are similar a few other things about this which are really nice your shelf uh, that makes sense it has all the books that are on there uh, it is incentivized so there are badges that you can earn throughout it also, I think this is really important, you can link multiple library cards. So I've linked my library card to Kansas City Public, Mid-Continent Public Library. I can also choose which device to default. So when I check out a book, it'll automatically send it to my phone or my Kindle. Uh, finally, when you do a search, uh, and this is related to the library cards, uh, when we come up here, it will search all of the libraries at once, uh, which is really nice. So if I type in uh, one of the um, one of the gateway books which is really popular so it might be difficult to get it'll show me that book at Lee Summit at Kansas City Public and at the Mid-Continent Public Library which there I can borrow it right now so all of those library cards are tied together uh, I can use it in one app and on one screen and like I said once you get logged in the first time it saves us information and should remember it on your Chromebook. If you have any questions, of course, come to the library and we can help you out. This is a great new product from OverDrive and we're hoping that it will encourage more of our students to use the eBooks.